A dragon sculpture that has been enjoyed by generations of Nashvilleans at a local park has been restored. As New Channel 5's Alexander Cohen found out, the work wouldn't have been completed without the community's support. As the ribbon was cut, they put the dragon back in Dragon Park. Kids ran to the restored dragon. This wouldn't be possible without five-year-old Alex Angus. He loves the dragon. He was so heartbroken when it was closed off. Alex went door to door raising a dollar for the dragon. It really just took off and he kept going with it and it's been a real wonderful experience. Nearly $200,000 was raised for the restoration project. This experience is going to be life-changing for him and for us as a family just because it shows that he can actually um, make a difference on the things that he cares about. The dragon at Fannie Mae D's Park was falling apart several years ago, so this part of the park was closed in 2016. One mom tells me her son has been waiting two years to climb to the top of the dragon. Because if there's a challenge in getting up to the top of something like this, and he's been waiting to do it for two years. An artist built the dragon in the 1980s. I think it sparks your imagination, right? It's all about adventure. This dragon has developed into an icon for the Hillsboro Weston community. Behind me is probably one of the clearest indicators of what a great neighborhood in our community can do. Mayor Briley says the dragon symbolizes revitalization in our city's history. You know, back in the 1970s, our city started to see its neighborhoods reinvigorated. No neighborhood more so than this neighborhood led that movement. So as kids climb and play, little Alex says life is good. Reporting in Nashville. Long live the dragon! Alexandra Cohen, New Channel 5. The Hillsborough West End Neighborhood Association is still raising money to help maintain the dragon. We have the fundraising page and some more information linked to our website.